talk with Doc Rivers, coach of the Celtics. He said that a key for this game was to not concede any easy baskets. They're facing a potent offense, and they know if they make things too easy for them, they'll be playing from behind early. We'll see if they can take care of this. We will indeed. All right, Gerald. Final. From deep, Garnett snatches the defensive rebound. 23 seconds left in the first. Dishes it to Garnett. Backs him down. Garnett did a nice job of getting open and knocking down the jumper. That's a nice play. Fisher dumps it off to Bynum. The dump off to Fisher. Oda. Let's go with the three. At the end of one, and it's close. The score, four to two. The Lakers with the slight lead. Well, Kevin, they played great defense. All right, the second quarter should begin momentarily. Gasol inbounds it to start the second quarter. Neither of these teams, Clark, can break out of the funnel. You think when a team goes cold like this, it's also the time they fall behind. But in this game, both teams are struggling. A lid's on both baskets. It'll be interesting to see which team breaks out first. Leads him with the bounce pass. The Celtics will hold on to it. Down low. Rondo. The song rips it down inside. The D didn't respect him from that distance, and now we know why. Here's Bryant. Punches the open J. Bryant has made a living in this league hitting shots just like that. That was a tough miss. Hooked away, but it's recovered by Rondo. Bryant is tagged with the reach. That's his first foul of the game. He obviously thought he got the ball. All ball, but the refs thought otherwise. Poe inbounds the ball. Leads him in. My goodness, he can't be happy about that play. That was a... Out, out. Deflects the pass. He wasn't thinking at all in that pass. That's what you call bad decision making. Bryant passes way down court. Passes it to Farmer. Goes up. Gets it to the fall. One assist by the six-year veteran out of Arizona. 54 seconds left in the second. Here they go, Kevin. Man-to-man -man defense. Stay there. Right here. Backs down. Back door, back door. Six seconds to shoot. On the mark with the fadeaway. He didn't need the fade there. But he knocked down the shot. So you can't argue with the result. Kobe takes it up. Gasol gets a good look. Snaps the net. Poe inbounds the ball. Kev, you can't let him get the ball that close to the basket. By that time, it's already too late. Here's Pierce. Oda grabs the rock. Farmer passes it up court. Kobe drops it. The buzzer beater. The clock runs out and we're heading to halftime. The score, 13 to 4. The Lakers have a decent lead here. But not insurmountable. They'll need to keep it up. And now the T-Mobile halftime report. Well, the second half will begin in just a few moments. Bynum inbounds it to start the second half. The dish to Odom. To Bynum. Backs in. The turnaround, Jay, on the money. Sometimes folks forget about his decent mid-range jumper. He can knock those down all game, given a chance. 
Now for the Gatorade Around the Cooler update, let's check in with the third member of our team, Cheryl Miller. Cheryl? Yes, yeah, the Lakers came up for the second half. I spoke with Coach Bill Jackson. He told me that they've done a good job of being aggressive and controlling the tempo of the game. He said we had a good shooting half while they were struggling. Things could be more even this next half, so we just have to keep working to secure this lead. I don't think he's taking anything for granted, guys. Indeed, they have really had a hot start, but you can't count on that continue. That's right. Shooting streaks tend to balance out over the course of the game. That's why you have to play solid defense, too. And great finish in traffic. Oh, did a nice job there to keep the defense off balance. Got to the rim, and then the lovely finger roll. Odom. Laid in softly off the glass. Just put the ball in his hands, Kevin, and watch him go to work. He's going to make something good happen. Rondo. Swings it to Pierce. Laid in with the deep great all over him. Pierce is one of the best in the league at finishing in traffic. He kept through everyone to drop that in. Backs him down. Here's Bynum. Balls on. Garnett inbounds the ball. Five second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Gets it down low. Goes up. Pops it in on the way. The defense left him just a little window to get through. And he just ducked in for the layup. Terrific job. Odom goes up. Lays it right in. Odom made his way to the rack and put it down. Pierce. Got a hand on it. Both teams continue to fill it up as we conclude the third. The score, 21 to 12. Bryant has played his heart out. Five points and two assists. Yeah, he continues to make an impact on the defensive end, Kevin. He's made some key steals. All right, the... Pierce inbounds it to start the fourth quarter. Rondo takes it up. Crooked. Holds it down. Inside. You can't forget about him when you box now. That's what he does. He passes the glass. Fisher way up court. The song backs in. He makes such intelligent plays with the basketball. Always aware. Always a threat to score. Rondo skips it to Perkins. Allen. Nice board by the four-year mayor out of St. Joseph High School. Fisher passes it to the elbow. Backs him down. To Bynum. Five on the shot clock. Takes the turnaround Jay. Leads him with the pass. Here's Bynum, gently drops it in. The Celtics will take a timeout. They're behind by 11. 56 seconds left to the fourth. Get the perimeter. Back, back out. Garnett inbounds the ball. Left wing. To Allen, behind the arc, Perkins gets the board inside. You've got to keep them off the ground. Somebody should have boxed them out. Defensive board reeled in by Bynum. The break is on. Bryant from downtown tries to save it. That's a bad play there, Ken. I bet he wishes he could take that one back. Odom scoops it up. Kevin, even with his shooting ability, you can't settle for long-range bombs like that. The Lakers can just dribble out the clock to end the game. Allen, no dice. 
The Lakers walk away with a double-digit victory as they defeat the Celtics 25-14. Bryant is our Jordan Brand player of the game, and he was in top 